Thanks for tuning in. I am Nashwinder Singh from Norcal Controls. We specialize in custom DAS, SCADA, EMS, MET station solutions for PV solar and best power plants. Today we will be talking about energy storage systems. So basically energy storage systems capture surplus energy during the time of high production and low demand and store it for using during times of low production and high demand. And not a new technology, energy storage is rapidly gaining traction as a way of providing stable, consistent supply for renewable energy to the grid. There are various options available for energy storage like pumped hydro, compressed AS storage, mechanical flywheels, and of course, battery energy storage system, popularly known as BESS. Largely, BESS uses lithium ion batteries but there are other chemistry batteries available. BEST can either be used as a standalone system where it's connected to grid for the charging and discharging requirements or as a system coupled with the renewable energy source. Four basic configurations are used with PV solar system and these are independent like energy storage can be and the renewable energy source can be at independent locations. Uh, next option of configuration is DC coupled. Uh, that can be with flexible charging, meaning the batteries can be charged either from the re renewable resource or from the grid. And DC coupled where PV only charging is allowed. And the last but not the least uh, configuration option is AC coupled. AC coupled configuration is typically used for existing PV solar systems for providing augmentation of BES by adding second inverter and battery containers. DC coupled systems are more common for new PV plus storage installations. BES as a system consists of battery module connected in series or parallel for required capacity, storage and closure with thermal management, power conversion systems, popularly known as PCS, battery management system, BMS, and energy management system, EMS. Battery applications are categorized into energy and power applications. Energy applications are at slower time scale, whereas power applications transpire on a much faster time scale. Each BES has a rated capacity the amount of energy stored in the battery in kilowatt hour or megawatt hour as well as rated power capacity that is the total instantaneous discharge capability in kilowatts or megawatts most manufacturers provide depth of discharge popularly known as dod that is the percentage of battery discharge relative to overall capacity of battery for example 100 kilowatt hour battery with DOD of 80% should be used not more than 80 kilowatt hour from the battery without recharging. BES as an energy source needs to be monitored and controlled. NORCAL facilitates integration of SCADA and EMS solutions for monitoring and controlling BES function functioning for the site requirements. For details, please refer to the detailed blog on the subject by Nashwinder Singh and Jigisha Upadhyay, who are engineering proposal coordinators. Thank you.